being a cradle Catholic, you, you're instilled to go to Mass and pray the rosary and never miss a Mass. Well, um, growing up, it was somewhat like that. We didn't attend Mass all the time. We were what you call those sometimes Catholics. When I met Jeff is when we really started attending Mass more. And at the time that we heard Welcome, we had just started attending Mass again. And um, we were having some issues at home, some family issues, and we heard um, Welcome being announced. And we both looked at each other and it was like intuition. We knew that that's what we needed to do. And actually Jeff signed me up. I knew if one of us didn't sign each other up right then and there, then the other one wasn't going to. We were gonna, again, make the excuses. We were doing better on going to Mass, but I, I know us too well. One of us would have been like, oh yeah, yeah, I'll do it next week. I'll do it next week. So I just scanned the QR code, filled it out, put, our, put her name, put my name, and we were done. I honestly thought it was just gonna be like um, a retreat to get to know some women. It was something more than I expected. It was something like the connection with the other women and knowing that we are all going on the same journey, the same, you know, that we're living the same lives just different, differently and that we're not alone on this journey. Going to welcome, it, it did help. It helped a lot. It just felt like once when I returned home, I just felt like, I was light and, you know, the issues at home were not as big as a deal as we were, you know, they were a big deal, but they were manageable. I definitely saw changes where now she, you know, more patient with the kids and we talk and discuss a lot more intimate things now instead of flying by the seat of our pants. After Welcome, it's like, the um, the calling is there you know you can feel it i teach on monday nights for our special needs um group here that are getting ready for confirmation and then i also am doing um emmaus with so the with our, daughter. with our daughter with our daughter who um i wanted to go on that journey with her i think having both of us you know go on the weekend around the same time it definitely helped you know, she knew what I was gonna go through, but she wouldn't tell me anything. Um, <laughs> you know, and then once I got through with my weekend, it gave us more to discuss, more to talk about. We both would agree we're at a better place in our relationship, better place with our kids, better place at church, you know, with the, with the community at the church. Now we know so many people. I think every mass we attend, we could attend a 10 o'clock mass, we know five or, five to 10 people in that mass. We could attend a five, a five o'clock on a Sunday, we it, know all it those definitely people. Made, it definitely made this massive church very small. If you're just having an issue or if you're having, you know, doubts with your faith. And I mean, I was there at one point, there was there was a doubt before coming back to church that I didn't know if this is what I wanted to do, if I wanted to continue being a Catholic. And he actually is the one who's like, nope, we're, we're, we're gonna fix it. And going through Welcome, it's just helps you along that journey. Welcome has done so much for me as a person and, you know, not just a person, as a woman. It has brought so much, you know, Friendships, not just friendships with women, but friendships with the Lord. It really has, you know, opened my heart to to the Lord. And it's just, you know, I, I don't just pray anymore, I talk to God. And I think that's what Welcome really did for me. And I think that's what, you know, a lot of us need, is we need that friendship with the Lord.